Hi everyone, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. Um, just a disclaimer, this is an adult channel. It's not intended for or aimed at children. We discuss adult things on here and we take part in adult hobbies such as diamond painting, photography, reading and adult colouring. We discuss adult topics as well. I will make a disclaimer card when I've got time because I have no idea how to do it to make it look good. But I'm here to show you the pages I completed in December 2019. So last month, we're now into 2020. I think I did 12. I think I counted it as 12. So let's have a look. The first book was In Winter Dreamlings by Edwina McNamee. I'll try and put this up a bit so you can see because the lens is zoomed out all the way. That's a bit better. So I did, I'm not going to take the tabs out because we are going to do a completed uh, pages video of everything I've ever coloured at some point. Um, so I did this one of the gingerbread man in the gingerbread house. We've got a bit of snow. And um, this was done with gel pens and some markers, I want to say, but I don't know which ones now. Possibly the Crayola Super Tips. I'm going to say Crayola Super Tips. I don't think it was done. It might have been done. No, alcohol markers. It would have been done with the Touch Fives. So that was the first one I did. There was a bit of Wink Stella on there. I can't, yeah, I don't know if you can see it glistening. There is some um, gel pen and stuff like that. So that was the first one. The second one, oh, the next one I did was in Christmas Mandalas by Camellia Angel Cova. And I did the bell. And this is just done completely in gel pens. So it's very, very sparkly. I do like using the gel pens. Mostly, um, partly Link Shine and partly the other ones I've got, which I don't know what they're called. Third one is one we did on camera, and that's uh, from Festive Magic by Selena Fennec, which was uh, this one. Again, this was done with, I want to say, Prismacolors and gel pens. And I know I used the Link Shine on the bulb for the red, so you can see it shining. I think it was Prismacolors. I use so many different ones, I can never remember. Then I downloaded a couple of Christmas pictures from the Crayola website. You saw one in the end of November's. And this was the other one I done. Again, it's all done in gel pens. Different types of gel pen. Um, Wink Costella as well. And the background uh, is Pebbles Chalks, the Earth Tone ones. Another one we did on camera was from A Colourful Christmas by Colour It. I do like these books, they're just very expensive to ship into the UK because they're not available over here. And we did this uh, gingerbread house and person pattern. Uh, again, it's all done with glitter gel pens, link shine and, and so on. <clears throat> I did enjoy doing that one. Mostly the patterns ones I've done, they've all been done with glitter gel pen. Uh, next one is Entangled Christmas by Angel Porter, which is a creative haven one. Really like the patterns in this book. And we did this one. This one again was done all with gel pens, but not all glitter. So the Christmas trees, the stars and the bottom was done with glitter. I think there's some Winker Stella on the snowflakes, but the rest of it was just done with normal gel pens, just for a difference. So that was quite fun to do. I enjoyed doing the, tr the trees. They were fun. Next one isn't a Christmas one. It's a pattern from uh, the 100 Magical Patterns by Jade Summer. And over a colourful life challenge people to just get out a big set of markers and colour a page using every single marker in the pack without planning. Um, so I just, I've got touch five markers, but they're running out and there's not much, you know, colour in them. I'm waiting on a, a set of the Arteza Everblends to arrive. We'll do an unbox on that when they do. So I just used my 100 set of Crayola Super Tips. <coughs> and I did this. It took me longer than I would want to. A bit too long to send it in to Anne's show on her channel. Um, but that's what happens when you just, literally, I just took all the 100 out of the Crayola box, tipped it into a shipping box, um, then literally looked at the paper, put my hand, mixed them all up, put my hand in the box, picked a pen up and used that one. And that's how I did that. It looks really good. I'll do that again. Um, I might do it with the RTs Rev Blends. There's 120 of those. And then the next one was a nice little Christmas. This one we did on. This is the one we did on 
on the channel. I can find it. I have put a tab in it. No, I didn't do this on the channel. I did this. I started this one on Christmas Day. I thought there's one I did. It wasn't. We did sort of some of the. Uh, I can't even think straight, so just ignore me. Um, so this is obviously from Nice Up Christmas by Karen Heaven, which is Tatiana Bogema, who her little mice book. Um, and this was coloured with the 24 set of Faber Castell Gold Faber pencils that I got from my Colour in Heaven subscription. Obviously, I haven't received my first magazine. That magazine is released in shops on the 22nd of January, so I should receive it possibly the week before. I can't wait, or a few days before. But I really enjoyed this, and I really like the way the Gold Faber pencils go down on this paper. They go down really well. The Black Widows go down very well on this paper as well. So I really enjoyed that. Can't wait for Christmas again now, so I can do some more. But maybe I'll get some out for Christmas in July, though. I've still got seven books I haven't coloured in. Colour in Heaven Christmas Special. We did this one by Elena Lazareva. Again, this was done with the Touch 5 markers, I believe. Yeah, there's a bit of paper in, as you can tell. There's a blot of paper. Touch 5 markers, glitter gel pens, and pebbles chalks on the background. I hadn't used my pebbles chalks for a long time, so I thought I'll have a go at them again. It, you know, you can't, there is some Winker Stella as well on the stocking. You know, it's very faint these backgrounds, but I do like using the pebbles chalks for the backgrounds. I finished the one in seasons that I wanted to do, and it came out really well. I really like it, and that's this one. So you've got the mice in the trees. And you've got the, the, the Christmas tree and you've got the Christmas baubles and some sweets and candy canes. So this was done with polychromos um, on the mice the, and most of the sweets and, and the trees. Then the baubles were, was the um, Link Shine Glitter Gel Pens. Uh, there's some Winker Stella on the candy canes. And again, the background, which you can't really see very well, but it is green, is the green pebbles chalks from the bright tones. But I do love these. The only thing is this glitter gel pen did slightly go through into the next page, as you can see there. I don't know if you can see it, but, it is. but if I do a background on that one, it will cover it anyway, so it's not a major problem. Really enjoyed doing that one. Really enjoyed sitting down and just doing this double page spread. Loved it. Another Camellia Angel Cova one. In fact, I've, the first one I've started this year is one of hers. And that's the one we did on camera 50 Wintertime Mandalas. And we did the little kitten asleep in the blankets. So again, that was done with the Link Shine pens on the, the outer part and the bauble. And the inner part was done with the Black Widows sets. I do like the Black Widows. I do find the Black Widow's ones break, but the Cobra and the Scorpions don't. So I think my Black Widow set probably got dropped. I would certainly buy another set of them at some point because I really do like the colours and the way they're done. And I will probably mix the sets up rather than having the Scorpion, the Cobra and someone's set. I will put them in. But I have heard a rumour they're coming out with a 48 set next year, this year now. So I don't know. Oh, I wish they'd make up their mind because I put them in my book and I've only left enough of the dark tones. I haven't left enough space for any more because I wanted to swatch the, um, what's it? The Faber-Castells. Uh, so there was that one. And finally, I finally finished the picture from A Whimsy Girl's Christmas that I started in 20, Christmas 2018, um, which is this one of the elf. Uh, her name is Santa's Helper. I finally did this. This was all done with polychromos. And I quite like it. It came out all right. It's you know it's not the best I've ever done, but it's all it's all right. Um, so and this is only a quick video. And this is only about ten minutes long. So that is all the pictures I actually coloured in the month of December, and I'm really pleased with the ones I did do. Um, I've cleared some of the ones I haven't coloured in. Obviously, most of those were new. I've got, I think, I need obviously to put the loose one in my binder. I've got, I don't date them because I don't like doing that. I have got seven more um, Christmas colouring books that haven't actually coloured in yet. 
I know it's ridiculous, isn't it? It's absolutely ridiculous. And, um, oops, excuse me. So I'm just trying to get something. I um, will probably get one or two of those out in July and do some for Christmas in July. I'm going to be doing some work in the Alice special soon and we're going to be using the WH Smith pencils and we're going to be doing a review of those but I haven't decided what picture so I'm going to sit here now after I finish this video and have a quick look at what one I want to do. Um, but yeah that's it for now. I hope you've enjoyed this flip through of what I coloured in December. If you have please think about giving this video the thumbs up. Um, like it like i said thumbs up share it with your friends if they're into coloring subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and if you are a subscriber don't forget to hit that notification bell leave me a comment down below what you think of what i colored this month um in december if there's uh, if, one, if you want to flip through of any of the books that i've colored in i'm quite happy to do that for you just let me know and i'll do that straight away um some of them will already have flip through so do check through um, my other videos because I have flipped through a few of them and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!